All right, I'm back with another video. This shouldn't take too long. It's actually very interesting to me, the, uh, the Tempest SDR uh, type uh, programs that are out there. I've done a video in the past on GR Tempest and Tempest SDR. And then recently there was an article on the RTL SDR blog about this EMI. Uh, and it had a paper accompanying it that was actually, you know, pretty interesting. And it, it seemed to hypothesize on machine learning or something to that effect of uh, pulling out even more uh, video from uh, this this eavesdropping on the uh, electromagnetic uh, leakage that is happening on uh, various pieces of equipment here. And in this case, this repository uh, kind of went down and gave some insight on uh, what settings are needed across various different webcams. And so I picked up this uh, Waze Cam Pan version 2, and I've got one sitting here. And so the whole point of this is uh, we're going to take an SDR and we're going to try and tune to and, and pick up basically that leakage and see if we can get uh, an image to display in real time. Uh, anything else here? So you can you can kind of read through here. I'm very curious, uh, you know, as to the GUI and, and some additional things that does not seem to be in this repository. Uh, but but anyways, I'll show you uh, I'll show you two things. I'll show you how you can build this one, and uh, if you look back at uh, some of the the commits, doesn't look like a whole lot was done uh, other than this updated instruction for uh, parameter tuning um, and and I'll re I point that out for a reason I'll, I'll show you here in a second but if we uh, let's see I'll just go right in my home directory here or actually let's see I'll go into downloads and we'll get clone this down and we'll change in there and there's one thing that you're going to need to install uh, to get this um, built which I have already installed uh, prior to making this video but open JDK-8 JDK seems to be fine uh, that'll pull in a few other packages but just by adding that to uh, Dragon OS I should point out I'm actually doing this on a, a War Dragon kit here that I'm just testing out uh, that's plugged into a, a lower resolution a monitor for the time being and I've just remoted over to it uh, in this case with VNC but uh, anyways if we want to build this so that we can have UHD support um, it, it does talk about lib UHD 4.4 but I, I'm not really concerned with that works perfectly fine as is uh, if we take this make all Java home it actually works out really nicely on uh, Ubuntu and we change into our Tempest SDR uh, Java GUI and we should be able to build this uh, relatively easy uh, with really no issues. Now and bear with me I'm going to show with a uh, B210 how we can do this and then I'll show you how we can just do it with an air spy that comes with the war dragon so now we have this dot jar file built and if I'm going a little too fast I would encourage reading the the paper that's on that repository and you can begin to understand more about this technique and how this is working uh, I'm just mainly focused on uh, showing how to build it and getting it tuned and, and actually showing it at work so uh, matter of fact I'm gonna run this with uh, sudo just because of just the threading or whatever it is I can't remember that the B210 wants to set um, we're just gonna do it like this and so I should be able to load via UHD and I've already typed in a rate of uh, 10, 10 megs on the sample rate here and I'll load up the B210 <clears throat> And I used uh, this uh, display width, height, uh, frequency, and, uh, or sorry, frames per second and frequency as a guide here to kind of get me 
around about the area. I find that for me, I ended up having to do about 2800, 1772, and I'm actually on a frequency of 1090. It does kind of work on uh, 900, but um, I find this to be a little bit better. So if I click start, uh, I had already had this a little bit tuned from before. And let's see. And so this is me, you know, real time sitting here. Uh, let me get this dialed in a little bit better here. And you can see um, the correlation plot. So you can kind of see how this works itself out here on the bottom. Uh, let, me, let me come back here. So what you're seeing right now is this, this leakage and the uh, Tempest SDR, that's my hand right there. This is actually the antenna sitting in front of it. If I pull out the phone, <clears throat> you'll see that, uh, let's see, let's see I can use, so this, this camera's uh, wireless um, connected to a an encrypted wireless uh, network so I'll just point that out uh, but we're not really doing anything with the uh, that wireless so it doesn't really matter but this is me moving the camera around there's my keyboard there's the phone so pretty <laughs> I don't know why this just blows my mind but there's me using an SDR, looking at the leakage, looking at my phone, looking at the phone. <laughs> anyway, so, um, yeah, relatively uh, simple. And the strangest thing, wow, I must not have actually, I don't know how I just missed that. Uh, just realized that during the video, I'm going to go back and apologize on the directory there. Uh, I must have been building or running something completely different but sure enough this does actually say Tempest SDR EMI it's got uh, record data wow stop record I'm gonna do a recording on here maybe I should have gave it a name home dragon system Wow, that's really interesting. Auto gain, so some other settings, take a snapshot. Well, okay. Um, yeah, I guess it just blows my mind right here while recording. I realized I maybe wasn't uh, building the right thing. So anyways, there's Tempest SDR EMI. And, um, yeah, it's got some additional stuff here. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop this. And we're going to, uh, I'm going to disconnect the B210 from the War Dragon. Might have needed to close that first. And we're going to... We're going to plug in the Air Spy. <clears throat> and what we're going to do, we're going to go to Other. And you'll see I already have a Tempest SDR in here that looks very similar. Uh, who knows? Maybe this is what I was opening and uh, thinking it wasn't uh, any different. But the cool thing about this is it has some other libraries in here. USRP I have to fix, doesn't doesn't work in this one. Um, the Air Spy, of course, we can get 10, 10 uh, mega samples on that. So let's try and do the same thing, and we'll let it settle down and see uh, what we can get out of the uh, the Air Spy. I mean, it could very well uh, be a little bit uh, different on the settings.
can still see my hand. Now it's tough to say I'm not comparing one to one using the same um, app using the EMI version of Tempest SDR. So I don't know if there's um, you know some some bigger differences in there that I'm not uh, seeing, um, but you can see that it does work. in here as well so probably could tweak the settings a little bit uh, maybe play so uh, I should point out too I really don't have like a special antenna at all uh, I would recommend um, probably going with what the EMI repository oh there we go I just needed to turn the gain up some so there we go there's the air spy with uh, the Tempest SDR that's included in the uh, the War Dragon, so let's, let's change the camera here. Just gonna start recording all my videos like this. the phone again okay all right well uh, hopefully that uh, was informative I do have some other cameras that actually are not on the list that I wanted to try I've always wondered if there was some way to uh, get information you know out of them through this uh, Tempest type uh, technique uh, I know I didn't say it in the beginning uh, but uh, the whole point of this is just to better understand uh, the article that was written for this paper and this you know this eavesdropping um, research that these people have done uh, this is my own camera um, so yeah not encouraging anything else other than just uh, learning a little bit more about how this electromagnetic interference and uh, tempest and fracking you know how all that stuff uh, works so hopefully uh, that was um, helpful all right Thank you.